What is going on guys, Bisectatron here, bringing you today's video and we are looking at the Super Minion, new Super Troop coming to Clash of Clans, quick video showing my favorite attack strategy after having tried it out a little bit. This attack doesn't actually go for a 3 star, but it's pretty close, I ended it before time uh, really would have ran out. Um, basically this is using the super minion kind of as you would use hogs or miners in like a queen charge hybrid attack. Um, so they kind of take the place of the miner in a sense. Go ahead and take a look at it, um, talk about maybe some different ideas as well you could, you could use for it here. But um, basically the super minion is a unique troop. It's kind of like the, uh, I think it's called the sneaky minion or something, the minion equivalent in the builder village. Um, where it gets a few long range shots off before it moves in closer. And you'll see that as we deploy it in just a moment here. Uh, good value from this queen charge getting both scatter shots down. Um, but they're kind of like a you know mid uh, hit point, mid housing range unit, similar to a hog rider or a miner, uh, but they are more similar to a miner in that they only they target any building. You can see their first attacks are very far away, making them a good funneling troop perhaps if you're just using one or two of them. You can also snipe some cannons uh, that are on the outside of the base, stuff like that. Um, but in this at uh, attack, they're being used in a big mass here. Royal Champion up at 12 to help uh, as well. And um, you can see in comes the uh, Battle Blimp, which is going straight for the Town Hall. These uh, super minions hold up pretty well. Um, you could consider using heal spells, but the rages are definitely necessary to really get them doing as much damage as possible. The freezes are also nice, so either one of those three spells, I could see you using them uh, with the super minions in a, like a mass super minion attack like this, where we're bringing like 12, 13 super minions to kind of cut through the middle of the base here. They kind of fizzle out towards the end. Uh, the multi-inferno is tough on them for sure. But I could see at Town Hall 13 or even lower, this being an attack strategy you could go to. Um, but like I said, one or two super minions here and there in a very uh, technical, well-planned out attack, you could get some good value just by uh, virtue of them doing some uh, long range damage at the beginning and maybe taking out a cannon strategically uh, and doing it for less troop space than like a baby dragon and a few balloons might otherwise take. So they're coming guys. Um, hope you're excited. Hope you're excited to test them out and we'll see uh, see what they can do. Thanks for watching this quick video and let me know what you think in the comments below. I'll be sure to check it out. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoy my content, consider supporting the channel by entering my creator boost code, BISECT, in the settings tab of your game and keep in mind it occasionally resets and must be re-entered. Click or tap for another video and be sure to subscribe. See you all next time, Bisectatron out.